Alright, this video is a lot of things bunched into one. First things first, the crystals I'm going to open today came from two sources. The first source was a very lucky alliance raids pool, and the second source was from Vega's uh, Austin meetup. Now, I just want to say real quick, that meetup was such a fun time, I genuinely enjoyed it, and it was so just awesome to see some people that flew in from the uk even just to be there like you know my boy t jarvis i got to meet him that was fantastic and one thing about that little meetup was there was an in meetup tournament and if you won that tournament you got a kabam sponsored prize and you know it would have been really nice to win that tournament because you know that's just like an extra crystal for this video and to probably everyone's surprise i actually did win that tournament so we got an extra crystal for this video from that tournament and additionally there was this uh little like promo code at the meetup so we have that as well to open and there is no mail for these rewards, so I'll just tell you straight up what I got. Uh, for the promo code, it was a 7-star basic crystal. And for winning the tournament, I got a straight up full-on titan crystal. That is massive, man. That is such a good reward for just going to a meetup. And like, my intention wasn't to win a tournament or anything, right? It was just to hang out with my friends. But on top of that... I, I won the tournament and then I get a titan crystal for it like that's that's awesome man uh, yeah the meetup was such a great time huge shout out to vega for like setting everything up if there is another one next year I am absolutely going to it so yeah but now we gotta enjoy this crystal opening and I'm posting this now because uh, in about five hours, the Black Friday deals will drop in game. And this opening has massive implications as to what I'm going to be buying for Black Friday. And let's just see how this turns out. So first crystal, we're going to land on a seven star version of Bullseye. That's a very good pull. He wants to be high sig for attack just because it is such good utility, like having that purify. And um, yeah, he's already ranked three. So that is fantastic. I will definitely take that. That's a great, you know, extra bonus for going to the meetup for sure. However, there is still one more crystal from the meetup that is really important, and it is my reward for winning it all. Now, I'm going to be straight up with you. My number one pool is one that a lot of people would, you know, <laughs> uh, kind of kind of trash me for. But my number one pool is Patriot. I want to awaken Patriot. I really like that character. I'm a huge fan of Patriot. Um, there's something about him that I just really like. I think it's just like his simple animations because you don't really get that too often, especially in 2024, but like he's just so smooth to play and yeah, he's also very fun and he is not like the best champion out there, obviously, but he's just cool and I like him. So yeah, number one pool is Awakening Patriot. Besides that, there is like Infamous Iron Man, there is Shothra, there is a Beta Ray Bill Dupe, there is also, let's see, um, Northstar, who I would really love to get. There's also Arcade, who I want to awaken as well. There are a lot of good pools in this crystal for me personally. There are just three champions I don't want. I do not want to see Symbiote Supreme. I don't want to see Silver Sable because I just... No, please, I got one already, that's that's good enough. And then the third one is Enchantress, because I now have a Sig 47 star Enchantress, and I think that's good enough, okay? I think that she only needs Sig 1, so I don't really want any more Enchantress copies. Uh, yeah, her, her, like, scaling part of the Sig, it's just whatever, so yeah. But if I can awaken Patriot from this crystal... That is insane, because I don't really deserve this crystal, right? Like, I won a tournament, yeah, but I, you know, you could argue that I deserve something a bit less, but it doesn't matter. Let's just see what we pull here. It's just house money, so, like, I'll take whatever we get from this crystal, and it's gonna stop on a seven-star version of Patriot, man. I, I cannot believe that. Okay, just, like, just thinking about it like thinking about everything that had to happen for this like outcome i had to one go to austin to the meetup i had to also hope for a good reward from the tournament and then the hardest part obviously is i had to win the tournament which was 
I still can't believe I did that, right? But yeah, I mean, there we go. Number one pool. Like, I can literally start saving my Titan shards for like Dazzler or like Spiral actually because yeah, I got my number one, man. Like that, that was, that was it. Like that was the reason to open Titan Crystals for me. Like there is also North Star, Arcade, Beta Ray Bill still, but like that was the number one. So like that is absolutely huge. But yeah, it's not over yet because I have some Valiant Crystals to open and I pulled these from the Raid Rewards. Now, I think pulling the Valiant Crystals definitely isn't the most, you know, my most wanted thing, but that can all change if I get someone very good from the crystals, right? So let's just see what happens. Let's just take it crystal by crystal. Gonna spin five, pop five, just to compare which one is better. And I see that seven star nexus. It is definitely making its presence known, right? But yeah, um, I'm already on cloud nine. Like I, I got my number one Titan crystal pool. So I am very satisfied. But I see that 7 star nexus, I see it again right there, and it is tempting, but the odds for this crystal are so small, it is literally like microscopic, so I expect nothing, I expect like some 5 star characters, and like you know, maybe a good old 6 star champion, there's Patriot who I just awakened as a 7 star, so as it stands right now, I am going to rank 3 Patriot with the Black Friday deals, but if I get someone else that could, like, you know, overwrite that, then hey, I'll have to think about it, like, you know, a lot harder, right? But now it is time to pop these five crystals, and let's see what we're going to get. And... Yeah, um... Just straight up got a seven star nexus. <laughs> uh, I, I don't even know anymore, like, <laughs> like, that is crazy, but... Who do I want from the seven star nexus? If you follow my channel, you know that my number one pool will always be awakening my seven star kindred. I click on him right there because yeah, he is the number one. I have been after that dude for so long. I've spent millions of shards, like tens and tens of mystic crystals trying to get him. A lot of dollars I don't wanna even think about, but I have been after that awakening for so long and I just, I just want it to end, really, right? Like, that is, if I get that, then, I don't know, I'll just feel, I can't even describe how I'd feel, because that was, that is my biggest hunt right now, so, if I can just, like, end it right here, after getting my number one Titan Crystal Pool, is that even possible? I don't know, but we'll see. Let's open this Nexus Crystal, Hope for something good here, just anyone decent, right? Like, you know, there's Dust, there is just a lot of cool new champions. And we have the options of Atuma. Yeah, um, we have the option of Awakening Kindred. <laughs> and, uh, I don't think anything else matters at that point. So, there we go. We got Awakened Kindred, my number one pool, by a thousand, like, by a thousand miles, my number one pool. We got my number one Titan Crystal pool, and this couldn't have happened at a better time because very soon I'm going to get a lot of rank 3 resources, and I think I know who the first two options are going to be for me. So, yeah, um, this was the best crystal opening ever. 100% getting my two number one pools that you just nothing tops that right This is unreal. I cannot believe this crystal opening was a thing But uh, yeah, love your thoughts on this crystal opening and if you're gonna spend in a couple hours I hope that it goes well for you, but just remember to spend responsibly and yeah, that's about it for me